After the first three minutes of play, the Lady Dragons held an early 4-1 lead. And after a brief timeout, the Lady Wildcats began to dominate playing college. The Lady Dragons struggled to keep up as the mass substitutions kept fresh legs on the floor. Fort Valley's pressure defense presented multiple offensive opportunities. Sophomore guard Jamie Gilbert facilitated the game and scored a game-high 19 points. She was also one of five players to score in double figures. Fort Valley's second biggest contributor was guard Antiana Jefferson, who totaled 16 points in the day. As for Lane College, Marissa Stewart led the charge for the Lady Dragons' late comeback attack. Like true SIC competitors, Lane College played hard until the end. But the young and talented Lady Wildcats proved to be too much for Lane College as they went on to finish 161. Coming in as the fifth seeded team in the SIC East, the Lady Rams pose a great threat to the tournament hopes of the fourth seeded Lady Golden Bears as they won their last regular season matchup, 71-64. Sophomore guard Courtney Alexander fueled the team by adding 10 of her 16 points in the first half. The Lady Bears tried to develop more of an offensive game, but came up shy by shooting only 26.8% from the floor. While the Lady Rams shot 43.9%. Sophomore guard Mecca Frost had ice cold composure as she completed a season high 12 assists and 6 rebounds. Guard April Thomas led all scores for the night with 18 points. Lady Golden Bears freshman point guard Shakira Nelson had 16 points as she went on to become the only player for the Lady Bears who scored in double figures. The balanced attack by the Lady Golden Rams left the Golden Bears clawing their way out of a hole. Kadima Cooper's 17 boards and 12 points added to the Lady Rams efforts. The Albany State Golden Rams seemed to manage the game effortlessly as they went on to knock the Miles College Lady Golden Bears out of contention by winning 67-63. to With their first round win, Albany State moves on to play number one ranked Benedict College. And Fort Valley moves on to play Tuskegee University. <laughs>